Good morning, everybody. It is 6.55 a.m. There's the proof. And honestly, I'm not as tired as you would think I would be at this hour. Probably because I was asleep by 10, for real by 10. I was really tired last night, but I'm going to 7.30 yoga. I'm going with my two friends, so that should be fun. I just woke up in my comfy PJs, still in bed. I'm gonna give myself like five more minutes of laying down time, and then we'll get up and we'll head to yoga, so see you in a second. Getting ready, listening to Gals on the Go podcast. Best thing ever. Okay, we're all ready to go to yoga. I'm wearing an aloe set in black. And then I just threw on this cardigan because honestly, I just have to walk from the car to the yoga studio. So it shouldn't be that like crazy, but we gotta go. I'll talk to you more probably after the class. I was gonna drink an energy drink before, but I don't think I need one. Maybe we'll get some coffee after, but. Hope you guys are doing well. Welcome to the vlog. I'll catch you guys at Toned. We're on the way. I just had quite the car fiasco. Usually I drive my mom's car and I literally got in the car, turned on the heat and the windshield was completely frozen over. I don't know if it would have like defrozen by the time I had to leave. So I just jumped in my dad's car. Hope nobody minds about that. There's a really pretty sunrise right now. I'll show you guys in a second. Now we're on the way. Got 10 minutes to get there. Here's the pretty, pretty sunrise. Everything's like so frozen over. That's honestly the worst part of winter, like when it's so cold, but there's not even snow on the ground. Like if you're gonna make it so cold, at least give me the pretty part, give me the snow, but you know, we'll survive. I hope my friends are awake that are supposed to come to this class with me because I haven't gotten any texts. I guess we'll see once we're there. I'm excited to do some yoga. I'll switch to vlogging on my phone. Maybe I'll get a few clips in the class. Bye. guys hi guys coming at you from 8 30 the sun's like not even fully up yet but i am definitely awake i didn't even get a coffee from my favorite coffee shop hansa i just got a breakfast cookie because i realized my mom has her new like espresso maker so i'll just make a coffee later if i need one but the class was so good i've never done their sorry for the lighting i've never done their yoga class only their hit class and i still sweat so much in their yoga class it was definitely more like strength than a traditional yoga class so i really liked it i'll be going back a lot this week but rushing home because i start work at nine i will check back in with you guys when i'm there back at home showered and we will discuss kind of what this vlog is gonna be because i know i didn't really explain that this morning kind of just a weekly vlog at home so i'll catch you back at home hey guys checking in it is a few hours later i've just been working so didn't feel the need to vlog i'm finishing up working from bed. <laughs> I showered right when I got home. It was kind of like go, go, go. I got home at like 8.45 and I logged on to work at nine. So showered, hair just air dried, put on some comfy clothes because it's so cold in my house for some reason. Ate my breakfast and I'm drinking coffee. And the only other thing I want to do today, probably in like an hour once I finish work, is go to Target. There's just a few things I need to get. One of them being a pimple patch. You can't really see on camera, but I have a huge pimple and I didn't bring home any pimple patches, which I guess was dumb but i keep like touching it and like when i have a pimple patch on it sorry if this is gross by the way it just like stops me from touching it so i just want to pick up a few of those and then a few other items there's a target like next to my house so that'll be quick i just want to vlog today and tomorrow it's wednesday currently because it's just going to be a few chill days in the life at home i am just trying to get back in routine after traveling a little i'm trying to work out to do work and to kind of just like get my life in order just that you guys would like this kind of vlog i love when people people just vlog like chill days like working out like getting into a routine so i feel like you guys might like that too today's a little out of the ordinary though i guess because i'm going to the blackhawks game tonight my friend julia and i are going to the hawks game so that should be fun i will definitely vlog that i love hockey games weirdly enough so i think it'll be fun it's 11 11 make a wish okay it just turned to 11 12 
that's unfortunate. I'm gonna finish up work and maybe we'll run some errands after work because that could be fun. Hey, hey, how we all doing? I finished work, clearly. I don't really work for that many hours, but it kind of feels like a lot of hours when you're just sitting on your computer and not really like looking at from the screen. So yeah, glad to be done. And now I kind of have a lot of free hours before I need to like get ready and go to the Blackhawks game. Right now I'm heading to Target. I think I told you guys I really need zit stickers. And then there's like a few other things I wanna get. My grandma had this really good creamer for her coffee. That sounds so weird, but I wanna get the creamer for our house. I want this like protein bar because I keep like eating breakfast out of the house and I feel like I should just buy what I like so that I can eat breakfast in the house. Target is literally a 30 second drive away from my house, so this should not be a long errand. I'm thinking maybe after Target we'll go to Starbucks, only because I have a gift card. I know they're questionable in their morals right now. I gotta use up this gift card and I could go for like a hot coffee. And then I definitely wanna walk for a little bit just because I have nothing else to do and like I'm trying to be very active in this weird week between Christmas and New Year's especially because my boyfriend comes in three days which is so exciting but I feel like I'll be a lot less active when he comes just because like we'll be going out more and like chilling around the house more and it's like New Year's and you know things get crazy so yeah I'm pulling up to Target not gonna vlog in there because that takes a lot of social determination that I do not have I will give you guys a little haul once we're done. Hopefully I don't like overspend and get like a ton of stuff that I don't need because that's what Target does to me. Why did I low-key have a scandal at Target today? Just kidding, that was literally clickbait. I did not have a scandal. Sorry for this view right now. I'm wiping off my hands because I want to eat my Starbucks sandwich. I want to wipe off my hands first because I don't know what kind of germs were in Target and I don't really want to find out. We're going to do a little haul slash mukbang for old time sakes. I got a spinach and feta wrap. There was a Starbucks inside of Target and I started getting hungry while I was in Target. So I was like, let's use the gift card on some food instead of a coffee. I freaking love spinach feta wrap. I know they're supposed to be healthy, but even if they weren't, I would eat them all the time. I'm also gonna do a haul of what I got, which is not that much, but still fun. Target is so fun to like walk around in. I literally wanted to buy everything. All right, haul time. First of all, I don't have good like shampoo and conditioner in my shower at home and also like my boyfriend's coming so I wanted to just get some better shampoo and conditioner and I've heard of this brand and it's like smoothing for frizzy hair which I have so I got shampoo and conditioner of this Monday brand and then I just got a big body wash I don't really care what my body wash brand is usually shea butter and oatmeal scented that's kind of boring that's for my shower again this is what we came to Target for the mighty patch the one that I love the most is the micro point one so it's $12 for eight of these so they best be working and they are so good like they do work they look like this and they have like little dots in them if you can see they like get into the zit so intensely it's like crazy and then i got two things for our new coffee maker to make my coffees at home this is the creamer that my grandma had it's chobani vanilla with real cream it's not dairy free or anything so hopefully it doesn't hurt my stomach but whatever i also got oat milk because i'm fake and i honestly just like the taste of oat milk i'm not like dairy free or anything probably do a mix of both of the creamers i will let you guys know how that is but i'll probably make one tomorrow because I don't know if I need any more caffeine today. There's my little haul. Okay, here's the scandal that I was talking about. So I tried to get a pack of perfect bars. I didn't really look at what I was grabbing, so maybe that's on me. And I just grabbed like the biggest box I could find. I go to the checkout, I scan it, $72. I'm like, what? Like, this has to be a mistake. So I look at it and it is a 24 count and like those things go for like three or $4 a pop. So I guess 24 of them for $72 makes sense. And I didn't mean to buy 24, but I had the person like literally take it off the register, which is embarrassing. And I was like, sorry, I didn't know it was so many. And I guess I'm gonna go back tomorrow for some of those because I didn't end up getting any since I didn't wanna get that much. But yeah, that's the scandal. I'm gonna sit here and enjoy the rest of my spinach and feta wrap. And then I will head home and probably just chill until the Hawks game, or maybe I'll go on a walk. All right, see you guys at home. Back home, I changed what shirts because I'm about to go to the tailors to get some pants altered. But guys, I put the pimple patches on and like one thing I didn't mention is these ones hurt so badly because like basically they're like micro points and you press down for like 20 seconds when you first put them on. They really hurt. If I go in public with them, I'm gonna have to because I'm just gonna keep them on till the game tonight. Right now I'm currently buying my friend and I seats to anyone but you. I don't know where I want to sit. Maybe here and here. 
we are going tomorrow excited about that the movie looks really good i'm gonna go to the tailors after this forgot my camera but the pants i'm getting altered are this princess polly pair of like slack pants they're way too long on me i have short legs and i'm 5'4 so that's why and then this pair of airy boot cut leggings they're also way too long on me and then this free people pair of jeans i put it in a vlog before they like randomly showed up at my house i think i ordered them like a really long time ago and they were like on pre-order or something they're also a bit too long Let's go get this all altered. Back, getting ready for my walk. Wow, the sun is really in my face right now. I just put on this headband and a sweatshirt, and I'm also gonna put on my super puff and putting on my hokas right now. It is still 40 degrees, and that is not warm, but I'm just gonna walk around my neighborhood, so should be good and not too cold. I wish I had like a podcast to listen to. I've kind of listened through all my podcasts and YouTube videos, which kind of stinks, but that's what happens when you travel a long time. So maybe we'll just listen to music on this little walk. It's a little later. I'm leaving for the Hawks game. I did a get dressed with me on my TikTok, but here's my outfit. Shirt is commence. I'm wearing this little red bow in my hair because I could not find anything black hawks and their colors are red. And these jeans, Uggs, and then my new Charles and Keith bag that goes with my Uggs. I think it's so cute. I'm gonna wear this and my big jacket because it's cold in there. I will talk to you guys either later tonight or tomorrow, but I will take some clips on my phone of the game. See you. literally 1 a.m. I'm back from the Hawks game. I definitely inserted a lot of footage here. I have my bumble patches back on. We Ubered home and then went to like the local bar for a little because our guy friends were there, which is fun, but I just took off all my makeup, washed my face, and I'm going to bed in my cozy PJs and I have to be up soon for work, so we really need to get to bed. And I bet I'm gonna be tired in the morning, but that's okay. But I love you guys and I'll talk to you tomorrow. Bye. <laughs> morning everybody it's 8 30 i am doing surprisingly well for getting seven hours of sleep which i know is like not a crazy amount like i could have gotten like five hours but i do not run well on no sleep so i'm waiting to literally crash i'm assuming it's gonna happen at some point but i'm up i'm gonna start work in a little bit I have my computers out i think i'm gonna make a coffee soon but i'm just gonna give myself some time to wake up first the blackhawks game was so fun our seats were literally next to the players which was crazy like we could see them like in the tunnels and stuff we were next to all the coaching staff it was awesome like i literally was making eye contact with them i swear we were that close and we won in overtime which was great it was such a great game but plans for today i'm gonna work my friend and i are seeing a movie at 1 45 anyone but you heard amazing things about that and then I'm going to hot yoga at 5 30. It's the same class I went to yesterday, toned, but it's a hit class and it's taught by a girl I used to dance with, which is fun. I'm super excited to go to that. So yeah, kind of a packed day. <laughs> okay, I know I showed you guys, but oat milk plus a little bit of creamer plus two shots of espresso. This is so good. I don't need to buy coffee out ever again. Well, until I'm back at school, but. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna start working. Check back with you soon. Hey vlog. I am just getting back from the movies. I just saw anyone but you and oh my god, it was so cute. I just FaceTimed with my boyfriend and he was like, it has terrible reviews on Rotten Tomatoes, which I guess is not that shocking because it was very like cringy, very girly, I would say. It's very much rom-com, but I loved it. Yeah, I just like shaved my face and did my eyebrows if my face looks red. I tried to spray the Tower 28 spray, hoping that it would like, you know, settle my face down, but I still think it looks a little bit red, but I'm gonna get a spray tan tomorrow. So that's why I just shaved my face. That's what's going on. I am going to a yoga class in about 40 minutes. I'm gonna leave in like 
20 minutes probably. I'm excited about it. I feel like I need a good sweat and then a good shower and a good sleep hopefully just because I went to bed like late last night and didn't sleep that well. I'm really excited. It's the same place that I went to yesterday but until then I'm probably just gonna do some emails on my computer because I missed some while I was at the movie. It literally was like a three hour excursion to go to the movies which is confusing. I'm also gonna drink some water because it's hot yoga and I literally sweat so badly I don't want to pass out. Hope you guys are doing well and I'll check back with you in a little bit when I'm like dressed and ready to go to yoga. Okay, I just posted a TikTok of the Blackhawks game and watching Kenzie Elizabeth's podcast. It is time to get ready for yoga. I had like so much popcorn at the movie theater. I kind of feel like, but but a good sweat never hurt anybody. I think we're gonna do actually yeah. Let's do the four three seven set. Brown leggings and brown sports bra. It always makes me feel snatched even when I'm a little bloated right now. Let me get changed into this. Guys, this may be my favorite workout set that I own. It's so cute. I love the cut of the top and the color and just the whole thing. Let's get a little bit more ready. Okay, I need to put the hair up and put a sweatshirt on because the sun's literally down and it's cold. My hair gets so greasy so quick, you guys. I need tips on how to not make that happen. So right back, please don't get into my car. I won't. That was my dad telling me to not crash his car because I'm taking his car to yoga. Funny. I think it's time to go. We're all prepped. Gonna throw on a sweatshirt. Guess I'll see you guys there. I'm back. So much sweatier. Oh my gosh. Honestly, didn't sweat like an insane, insane amount. Like usually I'm dripping and it's like unbelievable how much I'm sweating, but still sweat a lot. Felt good. I really liked the class. It was a lot of weights. I am going to shower and eat dinner and then probably just chill, honestly. I kind of want to go again tomorrow. One, because I just left my water bottle there, but two, because it feels so good to do that workout. I love it. I look gross. I need a shower. I'll check back. <laughs> Going to bed at literally 9 p.m. Gonna edit my video a little bit, but I'm so tired. Good night, everybody. You went to a party, I heard from everybody.